What's going on, Jeff? Oh, hey, Greg. This it? is looking awesome. Yeah, it's pretty cool, isn't it? What a difference a few months makes. Oh, yeah, grass is back, plants are growing. The stack slate earned, this is looking good. Yeah, so this is just kind My of the gosh. starting point. So uh -huh. an eye catching spot from the driveway and from the deck. And uh -huh. Water as clear as can be, as you can Hit, see. Look, let's walk, I want to check sure. this thing out. Oh, your papyrus is looking good. Yep. Wow, look at this parrot feather. They've already uh, thinned it out a couple of times, too. Are you serious? Yeah, so so this has been here for six months and you've already had it divided. Oh, yeah, we've actually split it a couple of other uh, areas down the stream there. Man, this water is healthy looking. <laughs> and the moss that we planted is yep. doing good. Still doing well. Wow, I love it. The woods, everything's filling in. It's just yeah. been a few months. It's been here for six months and it already looks like it's been here forever. Yeah, we've got the lights in now for, for nighttime viewing and the logs and just everything has really come together. How's the basin working? Uh, basin's great. We haven't had to fill it at all with uh, city you, water. We're in August <laughs> in Atlanta and you haven't had to fill this thing once. Not once. It recaptures the rainwater and it, it spits out any overflow and we haven't touched it. Mm -hmm. No algae, perfectly clear water. Yeah. That's that basin. It's that reservoir. It's all that water that's underground. How much, what, what size basin we put in here? I think we went over just a six to seven hundred gallon basin under, underground. So you're only seeing a portion of the water. Yeah. So it's all going underground where it's shaded, where it's cool. The majority of the water yeah. is underground and that's the key because yeah. the fact that it is shaded, the algae's not going to grow. How many aqua blocks do we use here? Uh, 16. So about 500 in the reservoir, you know, plus another 100 in, in uh, just rocks around it in the vault and things like that. So about 600 total gallons. And not one time has this been filled. Since not one time. <laughs> that, that is awesome. And to think the fact that this was just built six months ago and it's looking this good. Yeah, I mean, it looks like it's been here 10 years and natural fit to the landscape. And imagine what it's going to look like a year from now, let alone two or three. Sure, oh yeah, absolutely. Oh, this is spectacular. Man, so what, what size pumps did we use again? So we went with uh, two Aqua Surge uh, 5000s, which are one of my favorite pumps because the energy consumption yep. 360 watts and you get so much so much flow for that 360 watts. It's, and unlike a sump pump, it's made to go all the yeah, time. Yeah, it's made to run all the time. Uh, so we're using two 5000s. Uh, down in the vault, and we've got the spillways up above, two inch pipe up to the top. Mm -hmm. uh, we used about 26 tons of rock. Yeah. Uh, so it's a lot of rock, but it's a lot of big pieces. You know, the fewer rocks you can use, the more natural it's going to look. Well, I can tell you this there's not much you can put in your yard for under 30 grand that would have this much of an impact. And add that much value to the home. It, it's, you know, maintenance free, beautiful. Uh, so definitely add a lot of value to the home. Well, you guys did a fantastic job. This is looking spectacular. Um, I can't wait to come back and see it in another year and see how it's doing. <laughs> That's going to look great. Hey, good work, Jeff. Thanks, it's Craig. It's fun to revisit this project. Yeah. Awesome. So, Jeff, we put in 16 of these aqua blocks. Yeah, and each one holds uh, 32 gallons of water, so just over 500 gallons total in the aqua block. Yeah. Now, what people don't understand is this would hold zero amount of water. <laughs> so, how does it work? Well, I mean, it's just basically a shell that's designed to take the weight of the rock. So it's not like a milk crate that's just real flimsy. This can take, you know, weight and rocks and people standing on it, people driving over it. Mm -hmm. um, so it's and this creates void space over yeah. top of the liner. Exactly, yeah. So there's a void space rather than using heavy gravel. You can put these blocks in so you're going to save time, save money, and you're going to be able to hold more water in the end. Yeah, the aqua blocks are fantastic. Now, here's an actual pump vault. Mm -hmm. Uh, so this works, this is great. So th there's two pumps in this pond. There's more than enough room for the two pumps to fit in there. Mm -hmm. So they're protected with the, all the rocks, obviously it's disguised into the water feature. Yeah, show us what it. it looks like actually in the water. Sure. Uh, so the top is hidden here at the vault. Uh, so this section of the uh, pump vault is, is neat. Uh, comes in handy just for checking the water level of the vault. You stick a dipstick down there measuring tape without having to take the whole lid off and move all your rocks around. You just got this little, little, little hole you can check the water level with that. So the pumps are housed down in there. Mm -hmm. So of course it's very well disguised into the landscape. And the pumps are protected with all the rocks and everything around the vault. So no frogs or leaf debris, algae's going to get to the pumps that are going to clog the yeah. pump. Put it back up. All right, explain what this sucker sure. is. So this is uh, called an aquascape spillway and basically what that's doing, the water's coming into the back here. Mm -hmm. So rather than just Ball have, fitting. Yeah, rather than just have an open-ended pipe that's going to look very unnatural for us so the water's coming out at a high velocity out of the pipe. The water that's going to come in here, it's going to relax a little bit. It's going to get diffused over the spillway. Go well, through the baffle system. Yeah, the baffle mm -hmm. system and then spill out the 26-inch uh, spillway here in a real relaxed, natural fashion. So this diffuser, we put below this rock. Yeah, it's underneath that rock, believe it or not. This is designed to hold weight too, just like the aqua block. Yeah, this rock's got to be three, 400 pounds. Absolutely, it's Please. a huge, beautiful rock. Now, you can just see a little bit, if I take this out, 
you can see just where it is. So that's the top half of this. And the water spreads out and fans out. Just go like this. Ah, it's hidden. Rock on top, wood in front, water flowing out. Natural appearance. Yeah. <laughs> Looking good, buddy.